crazy video time. We're uh, working on cleaning out the storage room to move down to Mankato. And I came across this little bugger. Pretty nondescript, white packaging. And then if you look on the side, you can see that it's something called an Axis 1440 Epson P slash N C140 40 Axis. What is that? This is an ancient, and I mean ancient, print server. Today you can buy a lot of printers that have built-in print servers, and all you do is plug a network cable in or hook up to your wireless network. Back in the day, though, something like that was very much a professional super product. And when I mean back in the day, I mean back in the day. Installation on floppies. Remember these? Probably not. But anyway, we dig into it a little bit here. And, uh, junk, some, oh, CD maybe. And user license agreement. So, CD installation optional. Um, we get in here, and there's this thing. And this is the print server. Back in the day, printers used to have crazy parallel ports on them, and then uh, little metal tabs that would flip in and hook onto your printer cable. So this essentially would just plug into a printer, and then had an ethernet jack on this side, and then power plug, there's your power cord in there. And you would just plug this in to the printer, and then hook to it via your network. You would install the software via floppy disk. Ah, floppy disk, what's it doing? on your computer that would then use your network connection to hook up to the print server that would then print. It would basically pretend to be a print signal from a computer going over a parallel printer cord, uh, but it was all done over Ethernet. So it was pretty cool back in the day. Now this is like weird ancient technology. This is built into a lot of printers. And yeah, I don't know why I've kept this for all these years. I think I probably got this back in some really, really long time ago. Let's see if I can find a date on this at all. Year 2000 compliance, so it was pre-2000. Copyright was 1999. Yeah, dated December 1999. So, 12-year-old technology right here. Parallel printer, print server. I'm finally gonna throw it away, but I wanted to document it before I did because this was really, really cool back in the day.